Hello again, my name is Gabe Zona. This is the 16th of February, 2019. One of my viewers that sends me rather interesting tidbits every once in a while sent this. The video was published on August the 30th, 2016, by Alien Scientist. Title 9 11 Inside Out What a Real 9 11 Investigation Would Reveal. After 15 years of meticulous research and analysis into the events and theories surrounding 9-11, this is a collection of all of the best facts and evidence proving we had the means, motive, and opportunity to commit the crimes we witnessed on September 11. And who ought to be investigating if we ever hope to get to the bottom of it? Now. The video is incredibly informative and it will reconfirm everything that you've heard me say, which is it was an inside job done by our government, by the Bushes, by the Dick Cheney, by Donald Rumsfeld, Condoleezza Rice, they were all complicit. The only thing that I disagree with is the notion that they were hit by airplanes because there were no airplanes. What you're going to learn and see is individuals like Rudy Giuliani had to be up to his eyeballs in this. That command center that they built also gave them the opportunity to do what they did in the Twin Towers, which was to plant thermite and high explosives. There were no planes, but everything else is very, very informative. You're going to see how many people made billions of dollars, all because of 9-11. It was done by our government, and people are still benefiting today, 18 years later, that are part of the industrial military complex. And that's what it was all about. Greed. Undeniable greed to continue fueling the industrial military complex. It doesn't mention and doesn't talk about the Brady Bonds, the $240 billion that George W. Herbert Walker Bush borrowed, which was due on 9-12-01. It doesn't mention that. It does talk about people that made an awful lot of money betting short on both American and United. It talks about Silverstein and the money that he made within weeks of buying the leases for the Twin Towers. It talks about Marvin Bush. Folks, everything in this video you've heard me say countless times. There's no doubt in my mind, and there shouldn't be any doubt in anyone's mind that's even remotely sane. They need to be held accountable. Problem is, who are you going to go to? There is no one to go to. That's what's really sad. There were no hijackers. They were set up to appear to be hijackers. Bin Laden died in the mountains of Bora Bora of renal kidney failure in 2001. He had nothing to do with any of it. We'll see what happens with this 9-11 grand jury. I'll keep you posted. Thanks for listening. You might want to repost this, pass it along to like-minded friends. Let them know the truth.